was a scene or stir up no clash on second thought then it's by fourth she's on the job but she's staying on Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing fine. If you haven't yet, please subscribe. It's free, full of adventure, of course. And I do have Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, as well as Snapchat, and I do have my official website now, which is www.eprintshop.com, which is going to be right here, somewhere here. So it's a lot of services. There's a blog as well, where I'm going to share like much more details when it comes to everything that I'm, that I'm going to do in front of the camera, of course, as well as tips and beauty care, beauty, everything, everything that you can wish for. I did have my first lookbook, digital lookbook out live from, um, that was from like December 1st, so it's now available for everyone, it's free. You can check that out as well because it's really fun, there's a lot of like ideas when it comes to like outfits for Christmas, different types of outfits, as well as gifts for him, gifts for her, so check it out. Not gonna regret this and it's free, so nothing to lose, right? So that everything is gonna be here as well. So. Today was another lookbook. I've been doing like lookbooks like for such a while now, but I think like it's Christmas, so you can get so much ideas, so many ideas. Compared to the first lookbook that you saw at the beginning of the week, this one is gonna be much more like casual, I guess, not like for office party or anything like that. It was really just about not only show you what I got from Black Friday that finally finally arrived <laughs> and I bought some more stuff as well it was really to actually pinpoint my main main trends that I really really love so as you saw in the lookbook for it there was like studs, bleeders, tweed it was all about having some kind of the main trends for this year and that's a really strong that I love so much so it was all about like having that type of outfit today so this is the part that I'm gonna tell you how and why I did it the way I did it. So let's get started, shall we? My first outfit was these really nice pants and sweats. Of course, I think the pants, I showed you that so many times, so I don't need to say more to it. Bought it at Veramoda a couple of months back. I love it. It's the, it's my go-to pants. When it comes to like later, something black, something super comfy, always go with this. That's why I love it so much and that I pair it with literally everything that I could find in my closet. That's why I paired it with this really nice sweat from H&M. I've been eyeing this sweat for a while, I didn't want to buy it because I wasn't sure if I was gonna like it that much, plus I have so many sweaters that I thought it was just not a good idea to actually add even more in. I was like, ugh, should I buy another one, do I really need that, like really? And then the other day I was just passing by and just was just taking a look at H&M to see what they had and I saw it and it was literally like on sale. It was like 20 bucks. 
so I was like okay 20 bags you can take it worst case scenario you're just gonna give it away and that was about it because it was so 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 cheap I paired it with this really nice bag that I bought a while ago but I love this bag because they have like studs all the way around on the sides and then on the middle I bought it either on sh just fab or shoe dazzle just to add a little bit more color love it uh, here there was a little bit of like glitter it was black and gold the white and gold here just added this that type of like color add even more like studs to it i put it with my little boots from top shop that you saw so many times now so yeah i love the combination i love everything about it i think it was just laid back it was like basic colors and a little bit of fun my oops my second outfit was with this really nice skirt from forever 21 which was something that i bought for for black friday it was i think 30 percent off you can see here I love the part here. I think it's so like not vintagey, but it's like back to like 90s. I love this style. I thought it was so cute. It was so nice. I paired it with this really nice tweed top from Zara. It has this really high neck here, and then all the way it was like all tweed, and I love the fringes on the bottom. So nice. I think it's so cool. I didn't put it on top of my sweat just because I thought the uh, the whole sweat was doing so much for the for the outfit and I didn't want to actually like run it so I just left it in the back. You can have something so basic and you just have to add just one piece or just one trendy piece that I would call a strong piece. The strong piece of your outfit. I thought here combination wise it was really good it was really well put together to me just because i had too much fun i added my backpack from zara as well i think the whole thing was just amazing i i don't know i really i really loved it really really loved it so uh let me know what you think about it my third outfit was my favorite i don't know why every time my third my third outfit is always my favorite it's just like I don't know, I just realized that by the way. The top was this really nice high neck with the fishnet sleeves here from Zara as well. Bought it a couple of months ago. You saw it in probably in one of my lookbooks way back with my amazing, amazing skirt from uh, Forever 21. All studied on the side, in the middle, and uh, what can I see more? It was all black. When it's all black, you have to add details or texture to it so that it doesn't get boring. I thought whole combination-wise was so like edgy. It was definitely an edgy look again. Of course, pretty with my leather short sleeve leather jacket from Zara as well. Love the inside, so cool. It's really risky to actually put leather on leather. This is. Um, it's either a fail or a really really nice outfit at the end but again have to be careful because I tried it on, I put my leather jacket on top of it, wasn't too sure but then I, see the, I saw the end result, it was actually nice. Again a really nice way to actually pair everything together and then add a really strong piece which is my skirt with the studs. Of course everything is going to be in the description box below as usual, it's my really nice baby. Although I can't wear it anymore because right now in Canada it's almost minus 5 and we're just getting lower and lower so yeah I'm gonna wear it probably next year at the spring at spring yeah it is sad yeah. my last outfit was again another favorite of mine but um loved it it was not again really nice uh, I would say long sweater from Zara with at the bottom these really nice details that you can see here which is like all all tweed with little nice pom-pom here love it it's so cute it's so different and it's so just original and like cool it was so cute then again it was so big that I actually tried it on I was a little literally feeling like a little baby in it because it's so big on me it was meant to be big so <laughs> but it's really big I love the color I love the cream color 
I love the bottom of Cruise. So trendy. Like the tweed is an, another trend type of things. And I actually added this really nice boy hat, which is like so trendy as well from Forever 21. The only problem that I got with this one is that it's so smaller on my head because of my braids. That is actually a little bit frustrating because it was just only one size. It, I couldn't go any bigger than that and I love the shape of it so much. Then again, I know I can find really nice like boy hats a bit like that and probably a little bit bigger, hopefully. I'll keep this one for now because I bought it online, right? So when it arrived, I tried it on, it was a little bit frustrating, I must say. But I love it. I actually like just forced myself to actually wear it. And combination here, why did I do that? Because it was definitely trendy. It was a really nice simple swipe with little nice details. And uh, having to add something like that, I think it's definitely kind of twist the whole style and give a little bit more cooler effect to it. Like I said, accessorize is key when it comes to simple outfits. You have to accessorize it, you have to find something that's gonna like make it stand out. Like either necklace, boy hat, something that's gonna be trendy but that's not gonna be too much with something like that. So yeah that was my key here i hope you actually had some like inspiration that was it for me today i hope you had fun i hope you enjoyed it everything is gonna be this um linked in the description box below everything is gonna be in my blog as well so check it out i again hope that you enjoyed it i hope you're gonna have a really nice weekend and that you're getting slowly ready to christmas because we're getting closer and closer and closer so I will see you next week. See you guys.